welcome to another episode. That kind of scared me. Of Matt's Nightmares. And we are playing First Winter today. Uh, it's kind of an old school, like, pixelated sort of thing. You can tell from the background. Um, haven't done a Matt's Nightmares in a while, so I wanted to check this game out. A few people just uh, threw this in some comments uh, in the last couple of Matt's Nightmares videos. And I kept forgetting the name of it, First Winter. Um, didn't come out that that long ago, but I thought check it out today. Don't know much about it other than the screen that we're on. Um, has some pretty good reviews on Steam, so so let's see what Dan Sanderson has for us. The ten percent—it's always a good percent to start out off. Uh, well, yeah, that was fast to ninety-two. Holy shit! Okay, I can walk normally. All right, so that's that's fucking first blood, right there. That's a good thing to get away uh, around movie poster trademarks and stuff. That's the fog. I'm gonna assume this. What is this? Mm, that one's not immediately popping in my head. Neither is that, but I'm sure some horror movie fans will correct me and tell me what I'm missing. Alrighty, so I'm just in my bedroom, hanging out, being a nerd, and that that's it, I guess. There's no preamble at all, so um, let's 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 see what the, uh, this house has for us. All right, all right. Terminator, very nice. I don't think anyone is. I should probably look at these from a certain distance. They kind of pixelize right into the right sort of uh, depth of field. What am I trying to say? Um, resolution? I don't know. The pixels just make more sense if you look at them from certain angles. So, can't tell what that Gremlins legend? I don't know. Just 80s shit is all over the place. Let's just leave it at that. I'll make you an offer I can't refuse. Wait, I'll make you an offer I can't refuse? Okay. Matt, what the hell is wrong with your brain today? WNG 103.7, we'll get back to the music right away, but I do have some breaking news this afternoon coming out of the White House. Oh, geez, what else is new? The U.S. Navy is reporting it's intercepted a Soviet submarine in the North Pacific. Uh-oh. The suspicious vessel was first spotted around 120 nautical miles west of Los Angeles. A senior United States Navy officer has described the nuclear power submersible as being provocatively close, provocatively. which does not sound good, <laughs> and it's currently unknown if the vessel is equipped with nuclear weapons. The Soviet Minister for Foreign Affairs has denied any provocation and insists that the submarine is in international waters and therefore has no obligation to abandon its routine exercises. But it's provocatively area. close. So we'll more on this situation right. as and when we get it. But now let's get right back into the music right now on WNG 103.7. Okay, yeah, yeah, just 80s it up. Never mind that shit. We're all gonna die. So, so the 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 Reds are are gonna fucking nuke us, I guess. That's I mean, it was gonna happen eventually. Okay, it's pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. So there's something about those graphical style. I can't really tell exactly what's doing. I'm sure some some graphic artist people can tell me what exactly. It's just like dithering is on. I don't know. This really reminds me of something like I used to be able to know pinpoint what what's exactly being done here to make it look like this but it's pretty cool i i like this so far just visually um it's like it's like a high-res 3d gba game it just reminds me of how the gba could kind of do 3d looks a little bit like this i'm just wasting time i'm breaking down horror specifically horror games this is a very good setup just saying it's not exactly reinventing the wheel but you know this is immediately effective Oh, fuck! And you knew something was gonna happen, but it got you anyway. Don't like this music. I'll tell you that for free. Alright, well, that's good. It's locked. Fuck. Well, I'm already really fucking scared. Um. Well, fuck me then, I guess. Christ. Is there still gonna be a door at the end here? Nope. Do I see to pick it up? I press C to pick it up. I'm, I'm already fumbling with the controls. Looks like a tape. The cassette tape. The first cassette tape. All right, so it's collectible. Has this magically unlocked? It has. I'll close it. Oh, it's one of these. Okay, I wasn't sure, but yeah, it's the type that uh, is 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 doing math when you have your back turned and when you turn. Yeah, okay. This shit is still really effective. Um, even though we've, it's been a couple years since horror games started doing this. What we got? Tape recorder? That's, that's perfect! I picked up a cassette tape! 
I'm gonna put my back against the wall. There is nothing intrinsically wrong with being in a location if your actions in that place cause no harm or intimidation. Well, that's a sick rap, man. A problem may occur, on the other hand, if one is considered a threat whilst occupying such a vicinity. Vicinity. I have been the saying vicinity recently, and people have been making fun of me. A risk to her car. That's fine, I should be made fun of. What do we got here? Survival under atomic attack. So, we'll give this, or you know, some more points by this is, this is a different type of uh, scenario. The looming threat of a nuclear holocaust. Always kind of a tense sort of thing. <sighs> Fucking broom closets. I, why? All right, fine. I'll lock this. I, I physically can't be hurt if I lock myself in this. This is just as good as having a bunch of coats. Uh, fuck, well, f okay. Maybe this was a mistake. All right, well, let me know when I'm allowed out. Uh, maybe there's like a, a Wolfenstein wall I can open up. Oh, shit. That water looks really good. Can I see my body? No, I can't. Oh, fuck. Man, it still looks really nice. It also kind of reminds me of like a less intense version of what Fight Night does. Um, the first person puncher, not not the EA. So I guess this this is very submarine like, isn't it? Oh, hello, Denman. Okay, you got nothing. That's cool. I'm I'm I'm, I'm happy you're not alive. In the sense that I don't have to run away from you, although I might very well have to run away from you, regardless. I feel like this can be useful. I can clunk people on the head with it, or shoot cool, cooling foam onto them. As a kid, I always thought uh, fire extinguishers shot like fun foam that you could like play in, but yeah, it's not the case anymore. Ugh. Aggressive, aggressive, aggressive doors. Oh, I thought that was something the reflect. Ugh. Ugh. Bobby Hill? Kinda looks like him. Or is that a helmet? Maybe a helmet. Kinda looks like Bobby Hill's hair. Ah! Don't like how... Noisy this is. Is it an SOS, or... They hear me calling? This looks like straight up blood now. I didn't realize that when I walked in. Do anything with this? Am I missing something on the body? I am not. It's really not great to hear. Yeah, that, that that's that, that's the sound of something uh, bending or whatever in the water, metal uh, creaking. But it always sounds like a scary monster to me. So. Bravo, sound designer Dan Sanderson. Jesus Christ! All right. Oh, that chair scared me. <laughs> uh, all right. Doesn't look particularly comfy, but press E to use Morse code. Press E. To, yeah. I feel like I did that right. I was just mimicking what I was hearing before. All right, maybe I wasn't doing it perfectly right now that I'm out here, although I feel like something's really gonna jump out at me now. <sighs> uh, okay, okay. Uh, uh, oof. Don't like that. Close that, so let's try this again. Yeah. All right. Let's get out of here. Loose lips might sink ships. Don't talk. Talking destroys ships. It's the one weakness. Fuck. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Don't like whatever the fuck this noise is. And sound is playing a very key role in this game so far. Cassette tape, second cassette tape, great, fantastic, love it. Yeah. Go away, sound. 
It's like, I, I just don't want to even want to hear that mess in my ears right now. To retreat and save face, especially in the theater of war, has been a perplexity as old as conflict itself. The child may well tidy his room, but not directly after dressing down. Left to his own devices will allow him to decide for himself, or at least to appear to do so. Okay, I... alright. Damn it. Fuck this sound. Stop this. Ah! Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, what the- oh! Hello! Aw, oh, fuck everything about this room, really. Uh, alright. Oh, jeez! Okay, let's- let's get- let's... Fuck that effect, Jesus. It's barricaded. Great. Sick. Oh, Mac can use his old axe right now. Oh, somebody's trying to get out, so yeah, maybe I should steer clear. Huh? Oh, fuck. Uh. Okay, we're back here. Great. Yeah. Sure, why not? I close that? No, I can't. Alright. Open. Open. Nothing. Damn. Alright. Like, I don't expect a gun or nothing, but at the same time, I expected a gun. Or some type of military installation, submarine, or whatever the fuck, underground lab. I mean, if there was any type of combat to speak of, I'd imagine I would have been doing it by now. Something appears to be holding it shut. I, I don't know, maybe these things, they kind of look like they're holding it shut. I will I will back off for now. Oh, okay, or, or whatever you want. You know, I applaud this door's independence, I guess. But you are supposed to obey us, your masters. Doors. We put you here. Oh god, I thought it was a pool table for a second. That would've been fun. Alright, all you all you just close. Stay closed. I mean, I should say a few keyboard numbers to unlock. Well, I mean, I certainly can. Uh, it's, it's gonna take me a while to crack that code. I'll be honest with you. Thank you. Captain, you are for, for Jesus. You are four seven four nautical miles off course. Uh, proceed immediately to your assigned mission location. Failure to comply will result in severe uh, spankings. I just are right, master job. So four seven four. That's the only code that we have to go on right now. This is still not open. So let's try four seven four on here. I mean, I didn't expect that to work. It doesn't make sense in the sense that, like, what does 474 nautical miles have to do with a combination safe? Like, there's no story link to that? I mean, I suppose I can go back outside and, and learn something else. Do these still have nothing else in them? I just kind of thought maybe they'd repop or whatever. No, okay, well, nah, now I can't really seem to get rid of it. Close. Is there a bottom drawer? I don't think so. No. Let's try this again just to, just to be safe. Four, seven. Wait, what was that? Okay, that, 474 wouldn't even go. Um, because it, it requires four numbers and not three, but. Alright, let's continue down this fucking awful hallway until we find the right number, I guess. Uh, ooh, it's a lady. I can't, I can't see her. Damn it. Heather Locklear, who is it? Who's popular at this time? What the fuck is this? Picked up a locker key. Well, that's that's helpful. Um, it's fantastic because there is a locked locker, and I'm assuming. We're <laughs> okay, so I'm assuming whatever <laughs> is locked in the locker. Let's close this for now. It feels good to close things. Your locked locker. Can't wait to. Yeah. Cassette tape. The third cassette tape. Fuck. That's not what I wanted. Oh, great. Okay. Well, let's listen to that tape, I guess. This reminds me a little if bit of uh, anatomy. Then naturally, he will need to be disciplined. 
Standing by a subordinate's rash decision, however, is even more important. You should never allow the other side to suspect mutiny. No, because they can stop if the mutiny. If the viability of the product is compromised, then the reputation of the corporation will surely follow. Well, what even the hell is going to happen now that I'm in this room? I suppose just turn my back. And then just boo it up like BAM! Yeah, look, I'm basically magic. Well, fuck, okay. Ah! Alright. <laughs> that was a false door. I want that combination safe. Kinda don't want to turn around. Boo, haunted house. Fuck you. Yeah, I'm, I'll keep my eye on you. Can't go back more. Okay. All right, all right, sure. Oh, fuck me. Fucking shit, all right. Oh, well, shit, okay. Didn't notice that there. Ah, ah. Cool, all right, well. Yeah. Ah! Uh. Whoa, whoa, what the? Fuck was that? All right, let's get some. Let's get my steps in. Get my steps in for the day. I'm making this hallway longer just by doing this. Oh, by the third or fifth, by the fifth or fourth time, Jesus. Maybe the uh, ghosty with the most steel will be here. I just feel like it since it's making me repeatedly just walk back and forth. When I turn around one time, maybe something will. Or not. I don't know. Maybe it's not getting longer. I'm just crazy. Oh, oh, okay. Los Angeles. Ah, wow, that sucks for you, Los Angeles. Moscow's fine. Oh, fuck. New York, New York. I love New York, baby. Fucking shit. London. Don't want to go to London. No, you don't want to. And of course, I even see Washington. I didn't know. Couldn't really. It was too fast. I don't know what this is. Oh, okay. What about this way? Okay, no. So it's all it's all the the nuco blast that we've already seen. Okay. Well. Okay. Yep. Okay. Yeah. All right. Now we're fuck. Okay. Is this the same room from before, but it's just the water's drained? It looks like the same body, but... Nothing. There's a cool car poster, though. That's something. It sucks because I don't have a, you know, a, a number that we're looking for for that combination save, so I guess that's not really a thing. You can kind of hear a radar ping. I guess hammering home that, yeah, we, we must be in a submarine. Let me do that. Well, great. Break the loop. Wonder how long it takes for people. To oh God! <laughs> Let me out. No, it's locked. Fuck me. Huh? This is gonna be good. Whatever happens here, I have a feeling. I have a good feeling about this room. Tape recorder. A stalemate is the situation in which further action or progress by opposing Whoa. parties seems impossible. The deadlock must be broken for fear of one side or the other losing everything and gaining nothing. The knot can be loosened, however, if both sides become better informed of the other party's situation. That makes sense. More often than not, though, neither side will want to show their hand before the other. And thus... We have a Shagahod. We have a bigger Shagahod. Okay, so when I moved before, after listening to a tape, all the uh, tables fucking rocked my ass. So let's see what happens here. Nothing so far. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Alright, so it's kind of prepared for that one. Let's just ignore you clowns. Well, oh! Yeah, hey, I'll just pick up this key, you guys. 
You picked up. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Later, losers. Oh, let's go further down. Yeah, fantastic. Oh, shit. All right. Oh, shit. These babes. Oh, my God. I'm loving it. But, you know. Oh, well. There is just sexy girl posters in here. That's it. That was this room's entirety. All right. Well, this is where I came from before. Can I go back? Oh, yes, I can. Anything in here to actually do? No, it doesn't seem like it. All right, let's take a left. And a backwards. Why not? Let's take a backwards. Well, this is different, so... It's it's too far away to pick up. There's just... I can't. I need a bottle of booze. I need a bad. Ugh. Jump over, asshole! Right, let's go to the right. We're straight ahead in this case. Oh, fuck. Alright. Uh, combination lock again. I don't know. I haven't really gotten any smarter, have I? Let's see if the contents of this has changed at all. Wait, no, this is different. They didn't have another latch down there. Or I, I didn't notice it, but I... Whatever. Yeah, this is different. There's no note. Well, let's try this again. Use keyword numbers to unlock. I, I don't think I've gained a new number. I didn't really see anything. Unless I'm an idiot, which I have no to be. <laughs> U571. That's the only other submarine number code that means anything to anybody. Alright. Maybe not here yet. Maybe I'm too stupid. I've not gained enough insight. So I came down here, so let's try this way. Great, yeah, pick up a valve. It, what have they done for the Steam store? Nothing. This box requires a key. Well, okay. Uh, let's just make it so that uh, people can release more crap garbo on Steam. This is not one of those things. This is pretty good, honestly. So, fuck me, I guess. That seems like an important room. There's a man! There's a man guy! Blueprint scan identify. Hey! Man guy, let me in. He's like, hey, no one's allowed. It's gonna be like the uh, dog in Silent Hill and it's been manipulating everything that's been happening. Fuck, well, I don't know what I expected. That's not, that's not happening. Okay, well, I don't have a code and, and this had nothing there, so. As a valve, so I guess we'll find a place for the valve. Oh, here we go. And spin that wheel. Watch it just flood more water in. I'm guessing it's gonna drain downstairs because it's the only place with water, so let's see. I'd like to think there's Oh, it put more water in. Okay. That's um not what I expected. Can't swim down, not that I want to, because it's scary. What 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 did this do? I mean, it helps me look at the girly poster a little bit better, but that's about it. Doesn't seem to have helped a whole bunch. Uh, maybe it put more water somewhere else? Can I turn it again? Okay, maybe putting it on the water, then draining it again does something. No, you can't stop it or anything. It's just it just does its thing. Okay, well since that was the original state, was it being drained? I'm gonna assume that that's what I need to do, and maybe we'll investigate another part of the ship. Meanwhile, I don't remember anything else going down. Okay, I don't remember anything else going down. That's where I picked up the valve. No, he's still like, no. Why can't I just yell at him? Like I was doing before, it didn't seem to work. There's a key on top of the bed. And I missed it before because now I'm at, at least slightly higher. But, I mean, the, it's everything on top of the bed is obscured. Because of these railings, I can't even tell if there's an item and I can't jump. Ah, I forgot to check this room. Empty bottle. 
Oh. 2006. Okay, that that was a, that was not what I was assuming would happen with that solution. What are some good movies that came out in 2006? Let me know in the comments. I'm usually pretty good in certain years with certain movies like Spider-Man came out in 2001, uh, 2002 rather. Uh, Final Fantasy Spirits Within came out in 2001. Anaconda, 1997. You know, Godzilla, 1998. Uh, 2006 though, I can't remember anything offhand. I'm sure there's lots of good shit. I just, yeah, totally forget. Axie, I like it. That's a dork swing. That's big dork all the time with this. Somebody's just gonna hack down that door? That'd be kind of weird, but maybe. Hey, fucking stupid ass. Hey, let me in, let me in, I got an axe, I got an axe, I got an axe. Look at me, fuck. Okay. Yes, very loud, yep. Oh, whoopsie. Hey, hey guy. I didn't mean to do that. His hand. The butcher. Oh. It's not going well. It's not going well. It's not going well. Oh, you're gonna let me in now this time, fucker. Hey, idiot. Yeah, what? Oh, okay. Give me this. What? No? No with this? Did you set off the nukes? Oh my god. Launch sequence initiated. Target acquired and validated. Oh god. Launch countdown. 24 seconds. 23, press E to cancel, uh, yeah, one, one to cancel it. Oh fuck, 2006, I don't know. No, oh fuck me. What's happening? Oh. Did we do it? Did we beat him? Oh. Down periscope, I guess. Oh no. Oh, fuck me, I did it again. <laughs> yeah, I can't zoom in or nothing. Huh, whoopsie. The cassette tape. 60 seconds to go. The gravity of the situation was underestimated. Like a western gunfight, one party, it would seem, has drawn first. The bullet, however, takes 12 minutes to reach the cowboy, <laughs> giving both sides ample opportunity to empty their barrels. Slowly, the seconds tick away. Why didn't 2006 work? Damn it. I'm not sure if that's something you can even stop or control at this point. Turn my back. And then bam, yeah. Alright. Oh. Oh fuck. This is bad. It's bad that I'm here. This is a bad thing. Let's go over to the radio, see if we have an update -io. No. I don't. Maybe I should eat something. I'm kind of hungry. Let's go to bed. I I feel like I've had a really big day, so, so I don't. Maybe I can go go to sleep. Okay. Well, it's locked. Well, oh, uh, yeah, video games. No, no to oh. Oh. This is gonna cost me. What? What is it? Kind of bit. This message is transmitted in the uh. of the US ah! Office of Civil Defense at 3:40 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. This is believed to be true. Yeah. Let's just go back to video games. Okay, my video game is going away. Fuck. 
No, I still can't. I, they won't let me play. Ah, whoa, shit! First winter. That is by Dan uh, Sanderson. The first nuclear winter. So there's multiple endings, I guess. Uh, for my wife supported me for months while I made this thing. Well, uh, that that's a pretty damn good job, Dan. I kind of like these short but effective horror games that even if you're not doing all that much, um, they're, they're still effective. And that's great subject material, uh, the Cold War and, and such. Um, a little bit different than, than what we've played before. But, you know, that was quite good. Do um, you guys know of any other horror games I could give a quick look at, at on Matt's Nightmares? Please let me know in the comments or shoot me an email at mattmuscles at gmail.com. And thanks for watching!